अंकल राजा व्हाट्स व्हाट्स अप अप वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो सो टुडे वी हैव अ लॉट ऑफ स्टफ टू गेट थ्रू आई एम गोना टीच यू गाइस सम स्टफ मे बी यू डू ऑलरेडी नो एंड मे बी सम डू नॉट नो एंड वी कैन गो थ्रू देम टुगेदर गेदर बिकॉज इफ यू गाइस आर फेलियर्स I will send you guys to Jesus. So let's do this, right? And also how do you guys like about my new mount? It looks so cool. So yes, we're going to do is we're going to go through this thing for the guide to equipment awakening. So you have to finish wolf uh spirit fortress all the way to 12. and then you apparently should get uh drops of evolution crystal stones but i did the, all the floor right here and i didn't get any of those evolution crystals but afterwards even though you get the reward from the wolf you still have this quest right here the equipment uh, awakening The third part is that you go right here to your quest stuff and you go to war zone and then you go to war zone bosses like I already done one but I need to wait 27 minutes because I already did it for one second ago and it says that one of those bosses I I think maybe is one of those bosses right here this one I don't know because I don't see any rewards where you get a crystal honestly But it's okay. But apparently they say that you have to do it. Uh, you have to do one of those war zone bosses. I don't know if they mean like those bosses or the, you know, the, um, the bosses where you do with the scrolls. Uh, I mean these scrolls right here. If we go here, I think they mean you can do those bosses by this stuff. War zone summoning bosses. I think. but they said war zone boss so you guys have to figure out which one it is because i am still trying to figure it out because without that awakening quest is done you won't go anywhere with the awakening so we're going to talk about awakening more but we're going to go to demon demon soul soon right after i kill this boss right here because it will just pop up and then i have to you know take it off and then go back again i don't have that time so let's just finish up this boss so uncle roger wonder how you guys been anyone anyone any takers yeah yeah oh whose horse is this is running right here who whose horse is this ah oh, it's a so it's a sky yeah Yeah, I have little issues. I will post that thing also on uh, on the Soul Alliance why are they are recruiting people and it's not okay way to recruit people. So, let's see what is happening. Uh, but that horse is running around. Why is it? Oh, it's Sky. Sky, you little horse. Oh. Sh Whose horse is that? I was about to send it to Jesus but then I saw it was so it was sky. This guy is the mold uh 4 a o 37 server which is American but I think she left that guild for and that the guild she was in and the server for better active um server which is europe which i am in i am in europe eu002 uh if anybody want to play with me and my fellow aliens yes pm me add me as friend no problem i will take you guys in and i will for sure make sure if you need aliens i will make sure that you guys can join ours it's not a problem So yeah, finally I got that quest done. Okay, uh, let's see. Uh, 
Now, we were talking about this. So everybody was frustrated because they didn't get this the golden inferno on the first try. But here's the news, guys: you will not get it on first try if you are not a paid win player, which means you need to top up. You have to be topping up before. You have to be in a rank or something. I don't know, but I am a 50-50 on the top pay to win and free to play. So I got it in one shot. So you can go right up here where you see me in your normal pets, and then go to guardians, guardians of those. And you need to have those stuff which you can get from system shop. But I wouldn't recommend it. It's like hundred di diamonds for just one demon soul, which is bullshit. So anytime you get something by doing it, just keep it and then you can get the uh, list. And then you have wish list right here, which I already have done, but I don't need storm. I do not need them. So I need, I don't need this one. Yeah, I need this one and this one for now. So yeah, you can choose which one you want. So I'm going to go like this and then I'm going to go like this and then I'm going to go like this. And then you just confirm and then when you have stuff like those crystals then you just remove but that is the one part uh, um, so when you have those blue ones the ultimate goldness which you do not need you don't need those ultimate goldness because they are just bullshit mm -hmm. of pets or transforms sorry transforms so what you do is you go to this band, then you just click in that automatically disband, then it will just disband blue and below. So you don't have to, you know, check and go with this band. Then when you disband it, you go back here, you can click on details and then you can go to update and you get like those. See those stones for just level up your main pet or main transformer till you get better SSR transform. So you can see your you see a transform you want to do if you want one of those better than the other one which i wouldn't recommend to do you know here's the thing when you put those on defense i wouldn't recommend you to um level up those purple ones either neither those blue ones you just get like this yellow one right here and then transform it to the bond that the soul has and then put them Put those onto the other four you delete those stuff and then put the uh, ones that you need which is ssr and then you can see on the index which one are epic you have a lot of epic ones right here and then you have elite ones and then you have normal ones i already opened almost all of those normal ones i have few on the elite and then i have a lot on the El epic so this epic gonna take some time but i'm not worried about it i don't care about the transform for now so um uh, what i was gonna say is that don't stress about the transform uh you 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 don't need to focus on it right now so we're gonna go to um uh, forge right here They have made new way to see your stuff right here but we're gonna we're gonna skip that one right here but we're gonna go to my elements first like here i finished my elements all the elements um oh i can upgrade apparently let's see yeah i can upgrade this one maybe no i don't want to upgrade that one maybe i have something is better than this uh, let's see yeah, I have upgraded all of those gems now. So, like you see, I have, um, mm, yeah, I'm gonna put, and then, there we go. And then, yeah, I'm gonna set full of those. For now, I'm gonna use all of those, my gears, especially all the, all the gears and the weapons. Weapons I'm gonna do full full of dusk crystal which is uh, dark attack and then I'm gonna do fire resist HP on full set full set for now till I lock up the level 
and then I'm gonna uh, do like this. I'm gonna have only three of those um, fairy crystals, three of those like on this this side, and then I'm gonna change those three side later when I have all of those open. I'm gonna put something else for maybe I'm gonna put some. Um, let's see we have uh, yeah this is for the this is for those warriors so I can resist their shit so I'm gonna put right over here I'm gonna put for mages which is pain in the ass so I'm gonna put some mages gems on there later I think they are um, earth I think I think so I have no idea I need to ask I think it's water yeah water I think one of the, I don't know but anyhow I'm gonna do them later on so so you know but we're gonna go to awakening here's the here's the big deal here for make this set to make this set like I told you before you need to do finish the wolf uh, spirit and then you need to go kill one of one of those bosses till they drop the evolution crystal from the warzone bosses that's what he say or you can go to your trade house and check if somebody have uh, if somebody have uh, put it on a shop and then you just go like a dumbass which is you are a freaking failure and buy for the diamond they're gonna put in for which is dumb idea so yeah this is how you're gonna do it so um, that is one way to do it or just I think you should maybe top up and maybe you will get kind of uh, gears or items for it or maybe go to the shop and then see if they have something for you who knows and this is kind of weird I still can't upgrade my weapons I don't know understand why but I can still upgrade all other stuff like I already started to do a few of them I have done three here and then I have done two here so I need more stats for get the other ones from five to make it to uh, t10 so somebody was asking me about the mana brust so we're gonna go to talent and then we're gonna go to uh, where the hell is my mana brust uh, mana brust mana brust Life bear. No. And somewhere here I had it. Where, where? Yeah, there we go. Mana bros. Like here, it says what it's doing. I mean, it says DPS. When releasing a skill, receive one energy point after it's reaching three layers. The next skill will trigger effect dealing additional damage quality to 40% attack. Which means, people, that when you have this mana brass it doesn't matter which skill you will use of those as long as you hit a player or a monster or a boss you will if, if you hit like with normal skill like this a person or or, or mob or whatever would you say these days uh, you can get stacked with your mana broth will stack three times the attack you're doing and then on the last uh, stack of the three attack the last stack of the third attack you do on the same skill like this is one okay so you wait till it load you wait till it load and then you do it again there's a second stack it's getting stronger like you see my skill get any more stronger and then the skill will be slower and then you will go afk like that but then you do third skill it will be uh harder so we're gonna go for one of those monsters and i'm gonna show you guys what i mean so we're gonna just go and practice for the mono bros will always automatically activate without you knowing it so 
So like here, let's go down here. So if I want to use just like this, see, that's one stack. The power is in the second and then third. Like then you will get your stuff up. Like you see, you get only one skill sometimes. The effect, it will show you. So like here, let's say if we have a, yeah, here we go. We have one over here. Like this dude right here. Now check when I, when I um, doing the skills, you will see the, you will see your damage, how much you do. You will see that it will show first blue, green or yellow, whatever. Like here, like to, let's do like this. Like see excellence and then it says it changed the color of how you do your skills and then like see did you see it says ignore six plus and then you can do like this put up more of those stuff like that and then you can do whatever the hell you like You see, the more you do the skills, the more the Bonabrost will stack your attacks and make it so you will have more damage, more damage and more, um, what do you say, like more of a better attack for you. Like if you go here, you can see that you, when you click here you can see basic attacks and everything else will be like higher like here attack I have bonus attack is 148.8 which means when you use your skill it will, it will double up three times so it's gonna be like 152 or 151 percent of your additional normal attacks that's the thing with the mana brast so while we are on skills so i have all my skills to 80 so i have max up those two for now i am gonna max up these three soon so um when you go to talent this is how my talent sets looks like still this is how it, and then i open this one which increase your damage red if you have red stats on your gears or your when when your red gears will become your no your set of use it will have a lot of dam, uh, red damage attributions so this is this skill is very good to uh, max up to four and the same with this one right here you can max it up right now even though you are p8 you can still max this one up uh, uh, if you want but i don't think but yesterday i could uh, you know uh max this one up if i wanted to but i didn't because uh i think this game is is having some issues with the patch since the maintain so some of those stuff that are happening in the game doesn't make any sense so bear with the game guys but anyways when you come to p8 you just need to make this one for the holy shield enchantment and then you will have to have uh, you will have to have Imprisoner max it and then Thunder Flash Magic 2 that you need to have since since why because I already have uh, Magic Ignore here which I'm gonna max it up so it's gonna help me a lot with this one Magic 2 and then I'm gonna max up this Static Induction 2 which is for the uh, exceptions for the exceptions because it's, it's already max so so you know and then when you go to potential they have rechanged everything about the potential mastery thing um, how it look i still haven't figured out what this is you have to reach uh prestige a level 100 before you can convert potentials okay so it means that i need to level up for something oh yeah i can put my exp on here if i wanted to for some reason which I'm gonna figure out later on and then come back with a new video later 
like Uncle Fe Uncle Roger says to Stephen that he's a failure every day. Um, then you go to your mastery. This is how I did. Yeah, forget your mastery from zero slash five to zero uh, slash fifteen. What you're gonna do is you need to get your five skills and one and two and three and four and five. Uh, yeah, those five uh, you have to make them to level eighty. You know, don't be failure like Stephen. Okay, otherwise. Somebody will send you to Jesus. So don't be a failure like Jesus or like Stephen. Then I have to send you guys to somewhere else. You know? So don't be a failure. So make your five skills to 80 and then reset your uh, potential mastery first. Just reset it somehow. Yeah, reset here. It says reset level. Uh, and then uh you just quick boost it after you reset that part you just quick re reset quick boost it and then it will additionally uh re rearrange your uh mastery potential mastery which is very really good it's okay just do it and then you go to mastery and then you have to have used all your points that can be alkylated like here i have zero alkylated points so what you do is you just reset the points specific or yeah you click on specific and it says uh, you quickly reset all your path mastery uh, mastery pair points yes you click on confirm then it's going to be zero and it's going to say zero out of 15 and you welcome you failures uh, so yeah that is how the forging thing works uh, and then the the mastery and the skills and the demon soul and the holy shield there is a quest where you have to have a, a your tire to five which is gonna be pain because those shit cost like yeah it cost um 100 diamonds each so you need to have each time you left now i need to have three so i'm gonna do like three of those like this so yeah, I'm gonna do every time. I'm not gonna go under three hundred k of my diamonds each time. I get more above one one three point one. I'm gonna buy and complete this thing slowly. So I need to have it all the way up to here. The tire five. So tire five. I need. Yeah, this is tire five. So it's gonna cost maybe next one is gonna cost like. Two, four maybe of those but it's still 100 which is this is really good in this uh, investment with your blue diamonds i would recommend to do it uh when you need to pass a tire so just buy so do like me if you like to do if you have a lot of um if you have a lot of diamonds just do three at a at a time like you do three today then three tomorrow because you will get more diamonds the more the quests and the event stuff you do so don't waste your diamond just because you have diamonds do the important stuff um i know i promise you guys to i will come with a um warrior uh video but it's gonna have to be delayed because i have some some uh, mage mangus mage stuff to do and so uh, it's gonna be a little late about it but it's okay um oh wow i completed this thing also nice let's see yeah i'm just gonna activate everything um yeah i completed almost i just need to complete this too but I completed the red one which is hard as hell like here it's the same I completed those things and here also I completed them and then those those one I, I, I would recommend for everybody that doing the artifactal uh, artifact that complete those yellow ones first because they are the hardest one to do you need a lot of uh, magic crystals and you need a lot of um, a lot of red crystals i had five five mil of uh, uh what it called uh, uh, magic crystal but i used those to my gears so like here i finished this one so i'm starting with this one soon and then i finished this things to here 
and then I'm I open up those two now like you saw then I'm gonna do it those later so I have like what I, what do I have I have only this one yeah I have only a three left to to do and then I'm gonna focus on those purple one and max them to red then I'll be done with the artifacts till the next tire coming up uh, <clears throat> so there's some changes right here like you see there is no you can switch off your uh, fashion or anything so that thing you have to go to your fashion i'm going to show you later but this is the thing secret code exchange which is i know there's another game that had the same function it means that that on that game they will send one of those nsps that have this exchange secret code will send on event time or when it's gift time i think it will send you personally on your email box a code and then you just type it in here like blah 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 or like uh i will send you to jesus like you're gonna type in here then exchange it, and then you get to get stuff stuff for your character uh so uh since you don't have any you know you can't take off your um fashion you go to costumes and then you just remove them you just click on them and then you just remove them not the artifact but the but the set that you have you can remove them from here and uh, script descriptions i already opened the fourth page like you see here i can open this one also but i need to be p20 um, then i'm gonna go upgrade this for just for fun let's see if i can get yeah i go up and down with this shit and it's not okay yeah, I got up to the 10. Nice. Uh, so I have here, I always start with those purple ones or the blue ones until I get one of those stuff like here. So I think you guys can inscription better than me. So I won't budge for it. And then I have done, I need to rearrange all of those through four. Uh, wings with the plums i need to redo my plums like i'm gonna do like this one right here i only need one set of uh plum like i have all four basic of justice like if you go to your uh you can all you can apparently exchange i can exchange so if i want to exchange something i will take i'm gonna do this one so yeah, now I have it in my bag. Like you see, hide the equipment one, then overlay. So here it doesn't say which one it want me to exchange. So if I wanted to do like this, replace it, and I do like this, it quit it. Then it says like, I can do like this. So, yeah, then it's going to be like this advanced block defense, like you see, but I'm going to go back and replace this one right here. So you can see what you get if you put two or four of four of the same, I get damage increase, like you see here. So it's not a, so you need to check your uh, stats when you put on your uh, plums I have basic uh, sword so uh, sword of justice which I get increased damage plus six plus four and when lucky strike is four percent chance and then it triggers damage equal to 120 percent of player attack power enemy with six meters of the target with 60 seconds scroll down so you don't need to have like I did here, like all the way to four. You don't have to have like this. You can do one of the same. So it's gonna be affected. Like you see, I don't have any attribution at all. So I can open up. So do it like this one. Then you will have like this. Remember that on the plum. 
uh, what should I sh show you guys more? Yeah, about uh, uh, oh, I missed. Uh, um, I missed that thing out. That sucks. Uh, yeah, I. Can't. So here. Yeah. Uh, there is a lot of stuff on the game, and then also uh, the new Sumunor is coming also. So they are being sneaky with those pictures right here, like this one. They are being so sneaky about it. Think that we are done. We don't know that they are releasing the new Sumunor, which I am maybe gonna, maybe will, um, maybe will transfer to a Sumunor later with this main account. I will see how I do. I don't know yet, but somehow I will do it. But there is something else. Last thing that I'm gonna show you guys about the new pets. Uh, you can go which for those three right here like I see here. I already activated so I don't need it. The, the uh, dog princess then you have the other two devil and uh, what is his name is. Uh, you can't see the name but anyways you can go to your pets. This is one way you can you know you go here and wish wish for the uh, pets. And then yes hopefully you will get it one or other way from the Samuni. But then, then you have here, you have battle pass, you have to do those quests also. Somehow you will get, when you're done with those, you will get pets. Uh, like here, the guardians, demon souls, you will get for the transformations. And then you will get for here. You can get from here also, I'm on the round two because I completed round one. So I open up the dark princess so i think two of those the second round and first round is dark princess and then gonna be third and fourth gonna be the this dude right here that you see on the picture so complete just by summoning your pets or shards whatever and then use all those scrolls that you're gonna get so that is the second way to get those pets that you want and they are pvp pets for the pvp players which are really strong but I am not gonna use them yet because you need to have full uh, set of PvP uh, at least like on your defend. You need at least five of those for you know to uh, be a full set like those. The bound. Till then, till I haven't found them, I will not start with them yet. So, um, good luck with the pet thing, good luck with the, with the demon soul and good luck with the forging uh, where you go to awaken and then please try to complete this equipment awakening. Otherwise, I will call Steven and tell him that you guys are failure like him and then we will talk to Steven's dad and then he, he will send you and Steven and everybody to the Jesus. Okay, hiya, see you later on the next video. Enjoy and subscribe and comment and share and like. Bye bye. Hi.